Oh, it's then with less than two weeks away, people. Two weeks. <laughs> Greetings, one and all. We're here back for a Transformers review. Um, yeah, review or assembly. Green. And I'm wearing it inside out. <laughs> See, he's not got a joke on that. Oh, yeah. That's just me being me. But it's been a long day. Oh. I picked this up from my brother's death. I'll stop there before I go any further into a big pile of poo. I picked this up off my brother's friend at work for £15, which is a lovely price to pay for a boxed universe figure. <laughs> Uh, lovely box. I'm actually going to keep this guy in the box. He, he comes out. He can, I'll, I'll, I'll take him out and play with him, blah, 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 but I'll keep him in the box because it's a, no, it a lovely box. Obviously, it is a repaint of. It's a classic or universe Mirage? Classic Mirage, I think it is. Yeah. Classic Mirage, which is a nice mold in itself. But this obviously just uh, redecos him into the Stunticon known as Drag Slip. Very shiny box, very nice indeed. I like the shiny, the shiny, shiny, shiny. You think the Transformers logo, how shiny that is. This is Transformers. Do, 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 do. Um, let me emboss Septicon symbol. Nice, nice detail on this thing, I like it. Uh, open it up, and there you go, there he is. Try and get it so I can see, so you can see. Um, I can't see now. Obviously, you have his. Um, oh, fuck, on camera. Get it on camera, you prat. There's his inside of the box. All his strengths and thingies, if you want to have a read of that. Pause it now. And if you want to read that, if you want to read all that, just pause it. So there he is, all tugged away nicely in his little packaging. And there he is, out of the box, in all his lemony fresh goodness that he is. He's missing two wheels though, because even G1 has four wheels at the back, one at the front. But obviously it's a repaint, not a redeck or remold, it's just a repaint. Which is what they did back then. And like now, they just, they do repaints and a slight remold of head sculpt some of them. Well, good, 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 uh, good example would be... Generation Springer, Generation Sandstorm. It's a repaint, but also a remold, which is awesome. awesome. Don't own them yet. Not I don't own them yet. I was going to wait till they come over here or buy Autumn Assembly. Um, there's nothing about Assembly. Don't buy stuff there that you can buy now in supermarkets or Toys R Us or whatever. There's no point, because you're going to pay over the odds. Unless you're really impatient like I was with uh, Prime Voyager Starstream last year. I paid £28 for him. And about two months later, I found him for £22. And now he's about 16 but if you go to the BM shop, he's like 12 Ah, hello. So. <coughs> breathe, breathe, breathe. Lovely little yellow sports car. Lovely with the, with the red. He's, he's got a, he has gone, he's got no um, sponsorship shit that, um, What's his name's got? Mirage, I forgot his name then. And a lovely Decepticon symbol. An outstanding Decepticon symbol on the front of that. So you know. You know what he is. Very simple. No, obviously, no gimmicks. The spoiler moves. I think that's about it. Sure then. Um, I'll take you to transformation quickly because you've probably seen it before anyway. This comes off and forms a strange gun or a shovel head. Whatever you want to call it. Uh, separate. Like so. You can do this anywhere. You can start with the bottom or top first. Whichever you like. Do that like so. Fold the legs around like that. And then the spoilers become feet. The uh, legs are done. Legs are already done. Arms. Simple. Yeah. Push. Out like so. Rotate. And if you very carefully pull the front section down like so, and then pop that down for the head reveal. Da, 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 da. 
I have nails I can get the hands up. And there he is. This is a very simplistic transformation, but satisfying in my brain. In my brain, because just look at that. Look at that. That's just lovely. He's so lovely. He's so posable as well. You guys get some many funny poses out of him. All. Outstanding little figure. I recommend picking this guy up at AA if you can find him. All the Mirage, they're both nice. They stem back to a time where Transformers were already available to anybody. Kind of. So, there's a little close up on his noggin. Focus, there we go. See, see what I mean? Where it's just a straight repaint. It's not no even remoulding of the head, which would have been nice. To a drag strippy kind of helmet kind of thing. But, ah, it's close enough. It looks like him. And of course, that Decepticon symbol is still there, looking awesome as usual. Big clunky boots. Look at those boots. Look at that. The thing is, you get these get a bit loose, and that's the only problem. So he doesn't want to stand up sometimes. But apart from that, I would recommend this guy. I think he's lovely, absolutely stunning, and you can get him boxed even better as long as you get him with his uh, front nose of the car. Because to the gun, it's pretty much it looks like a it's a crossbow launcher, isn't it? It's a crossbow. Well, it is, he's crossbow bolts, there you go. But pick him up, get hold of him, he's, he's absolutely lovely. I've been you, you've been me, and this was Mirage. I'll see you at AA. Transformers.